Hey, what's up? It's me again. Uh, we had a meeting today in Chiba City, so I decided that I wanted to come and explore. I was planning on shooting the Chiba Prefectural Castle today, however, it's raining out, if you can't tell, it's raining right now. So we decided we are going to go check out some other things, um, and I have some other business I need to do at a couple offices in the area. Um, so, but we did stop off and check out a shrine. This is the Dozo, or Doso Shrine. There we go. Alright, so we'll go check it out real quick. Okay. Oh, the statue over here in the corner is kind of cool. You have a deity with multiple arms holding like a bow and arrow, a sword, uh, maybe some grapes or something, and like a small knife with like the sun and the moon up at the top. Yeah. Don't know if you can see that, but that, that's it there. Cool. You've got the lion. And another one. My favorite part so far is that blue dragon up there. I think it's kind of cool looking. And blue is my favorite color, so. Alright, so just a little piece of history and a little piece of tranquility in the middle of a big city. This is what you can find everywhere in Japan. It's pretty awesome. Alright, stay tuned for more. Alright, so check it out. Here's your crossing bridge. No crosswalk needed. Don't need to wait because you got foot bridges everywhere. Yeah! And check that out. Check out that train up there. I think it's so dope. And it's wet. I'm slipping and sliding, so the next one, I'm actually going to use the stairs. I just wanted that because I thought it was kind of cool. All right.
So, we've come across some dragon eggs. I don't know. I actually don't know what these are, but they're like big rocks, but they look like dragon eggs with some like sculptures inside. And that one right there. That's actually pretty cool. Another dragon egg. Another stand up one. So far, this is my favorite because it's very round, less overly. And then just another dragon egg with some etchings in it. Uh, we stopped off at a park, but check this out. The sculpture is super cool. It actually looks like a big longboat, but then it has like a mural inside, I think. Um, let's see. Let's see if I can tell what's in there. Looks like different plant styles like a little person maybe some trees a couple of birds the sky some more birds and some writing up at top this is some park here in Chiba and it's pretty awesome yeah and a train in the sky YouTube production, right here. Very serious stuff. You can just hold it from down there. Three, two, one, action! Did somebody say Dalmatian? Quick update, my SD card got filled in the uh, on my last camera, so if you see a noticeable change in the footage, it's because I'm going from a $40 knockoff sports camera to my GoPro Hero 3. So thanks for watching so far, and uh, let's see what else we find. But you're not getting the shot with the turtles and the koi.
see that fish? It's like, Raphael, it's it's Leonardo, this one? Yeah. This Michelangelo, one? and Donatello. <laughs> this is what your turtles are supposed to look like. Spencer. <laughs> Just walking through the creepy woods I, I in the middle of a city. It's kind of dark. Upside down. We're all dressed up a little weird. But there's an upside down train. If you want to know where we're at, Minato Park in Chiba uh, City. Okay, so we came over to this Chiba Port Tower. We're 113 meters high in the sky. We need to check out some stuff. So, here's what we're looking at. It's all in Japanese. I don't read Japanese yet, but check that view out. Look like such torches. <laughs> what are you talking about? We are torches. <laughs> 